Do you want to know how to install and set up GeForce Experience so you can use the game stream feature? Then stick around because you know what time it is. So the game stream feature inside of the GeForce Experience is only compatible with Nvidia graphics cards from GTX 650 up. Now one of the great things with the game stream feature is that you can actually stream your Steam games from your primary PC to another device such as a shield device or in this case to a Moonlight device. So Moonlight is just the program that interfaces with different hardware such as Android devices or in my case Raspberry Pi devices. Now if you haven't checked it out already you can check out this video up here in regards to streaming Moonlight on a Raspberry Pi and if you want to go a step further you can check out this video here and check out how to set it up within RetroPie on a Raspberry Pi. So how do we get all this working? Well, stick around and I'll show you how on the computer right now. So the first thing you want to do is go to Start Page or Google and type in GeForce Experience. Once you've done that, you should see a link there saying Download GeForce Experience. So click on that. And now that we're at the GeForce page, we'll just go to the Download Link button, click on that and we'll download it. Now let's go to where we downloaded that file and you'll see here that I've actually got the full release as well as just the GeForce Experience. So what we'll do is we'll double click on the GeForce Experience download and we'll click on yes. Once the installer is fully loaded, we'll click the I agree button and hit install. Now again, this will take a little while, so we'll speed up the footage and we'll be back in a sec. Once that's finished, we'll be greeted with this screen. So what we'll need to do is we'll need to click the get started button. And here we're presented with three options, either log in with Nvidia, log in with Google, or log in with Facebook. In this case, I'm gonna log in with Google. And just because I don't trust anyone, I'm going to blank out my information, but log in. And here I'll also blank out my password and click sign in. I have two factor authentication on my Google account, so I'll insert the six digit code and then I'll hit done. If you do like, you can click the do not ask again on this computer tick box, only if your computer is safe and secure. And now it will have us logged in and it will go through a very quick setup. Hit continue, continue again, and continue one more time. And done. Now to enable game stream, we'll have to click on the little cogwheel here and go over to the left hand side and click on the menu item that says shield. Inside Shield, you'll see Game Stream there and a little toggle. So we'll click on the toggle. And that's it, Game Stream is now active. So if you go to sync a device with this particular computer, then Game Stream is now active for your Nvidia card. Now, did this work for you or do you have any problems with the actual installation? Let me know down in the comments and I'll see if I can help out. Well, that's it for another video. I really hope you liked it. If you did, make sure you leave me a big thumbs up or even a comment down below. If you do enjoy the content that I'm providing here, then make sure you subscribe to my channel because it really helps me a lot. And as always, imagine, learn, create.